We have been really excited about this. Usually it's only reserved for the state title games, but tonight six different teams from all different areas of Idaho, different classifications met for the battle in Boise. And let me tell you, these matchups were a ton of fun. We're going to start out with some 4A action. The first time Bronco fans get to see Gatlin Bear, the number one recruit in Idaho high school football history, the number one rated commit in Boise State history. But guess what? On the first play from scrimmage, it was the Valley View Falcons taking the spotlight. Quarterback Eli Daniel rolling out of the pocket on the option, flips it to number 14. I apologize, number 14 wasn't on the roster that we found online, but guess what? He's pretty fast. Gonna take this one to the house, giving the Falcons the early lead in this one. That Valley View defense would keep up the momentum. They hold the Bobcats the fourth down, but guess what? They're gonna go for it, not just for the first down. They want the whole thing. Mac Jensen lets it fly. Gatlin Bear catches it and does the rest. Guess what, Bronco Nation? You can get used to seeing that. His first touchdown on the blue, hopefully the first of many to come two years from now. Well, Valley View wastes no time driving down the other way. They get a nice run up the gut for that burly defense. Hawks to the ball, rips it out, and recovers. Took a second for the refs to talk it over, but that's going to be burly football. They make the call, and Burley's air attack was something special tonight. Jensen getting another one. Look at the fighting effort from number eight. We weren't able to get his jersey tonight either. That's our bad, but hey, Pretty big play from him. And I'll tell you what, how about one more for good measure? Another ball to Bear. Mac Jensen, way deep. Bear all alone to reel it in. 59 to 27 late in the fourth. It looks like Burley's running away with it. But like we said, this one got started a little bit late. So we'll have that final for you online at KTVB.com.